There are many factors that can make or break a vacation or long haul trip. But one of the most considerable is having access to your electronics and appliances when you need them. Before traveling, it's important to know there will be enough battery power to run these items. Xantrex Solar Solutions can help extend your battery service life by keeping batteries topped off and providing power to smaller loads, meaning more available power for battery charging and running your electronic devices. A properly designed solar system, provided you are in an area where sunshine is available, may power your entire electrical system. The first step is to figure out how many solar panels you need to be self-sufficient. This involves a bit of math. The number of solar panels you need depends on how much energy you use on a daily basis. You'll want to make a list of every device you want to run off your solar system. Every appliance will have a power consumption rating label. Look for the output rating. For your calculation, you'll need to know the wattage of each device. If the devices are listed in another value, then you'll need to use these equations to find the wattage. Watts equals volts multiplied by amps. Milliamps divided by 1000 equals amps. Estimate how many hours you'll be using each device every day. Take the output wattage and multiply that by your usage hours. Now you have your watt hours per day. Battery banks are determined in amp hours so go ahead and divide your total watt hours per day by the battery bank voltage, 12 volts. This number is your total amp hours per day. A Xantrax 160 watt panel can produce about 8.34 amps per peak sun hour. Assuming you get an average of five and a half peak sun hours per day, it will produce about 8.34 amps multiplied by five and a half hours which means one 160 watt solar panel produces an average of 45.87 amp hours per day. In this example, the total power consumption is 170 amp hours per day. Add 10% to account for losses and inefficiencies resulting from power conversion, which brings the total requirement to 170 multiplied by 1.1, which equals 187. Divide 187 by 45.87 to get the number of solar panels needed to support the entire system. In this case, you need four 160 watt solar panels. If you plan to run a generator or plug in daily, but need the batteries to last longer throughout the day, you could decrease the number of panels to simply support the battery charge cycle.